moving back to music. Um, so you mentioned Rock Kim. Yeah. Is that like someone that like you grew up on, or like yes. who, like who'd you grow up on? Okay, so on? in that era, I would say my favorites are, and and they're probably in my top ten of all time of that era. Would you know? It's like, and obviously they're still going, but they probably had the most impact in that era would be, you know, Rakim, Karis One, Yes. Cool G Rap, Big Daddy Kane. Hell yeah. You know, sort of that, um, that. You can definitely, like, hear the influences, like, in your music. Oh, can you? Okay. I yeah. mean, like, just like, I, you know, like, with my guitar parts, like, you know, it's obvious who I grew up listening to. Right, yeah. Well, I was saying, like, even in that track, I'm like, okay, this reminds me of like Microphone Fiend. Average yeah, oh, nice. Light, average Hell white yeah. band, you know. Yeah, yeah. Like that that guitar line reminded me of that. Oh, when cool. I first, and I love that, you know. I mean, I take that as a compliment. Yeah, Those guys totally. Are great. <laughs> yeah, to, I, you know, I love all that stuff. Like I, the thing is, I really love that era of hip hop, and I love the era of funk that that era sampled. Agreed. You know what I mean? Yeah, so, yeah. It was a nice like mesh. It was like so musical, up. you know. Yeah, it was, yeah, totally. So that that's like when you shot me your track, I was like, okay, this kind of, I knew exactly what I wanted to do as soon as I heard the track because it, it just sort of, it yeah, it, it hit that that touchstone for me. You yeah, know? you were the, you were the first person I even reached out to because it was like so obvious to me that like you could kill it on this track. Thank you. <laughs> I'll drink to that. Yeah, because there's you. not too many like you know, you know that I could hit up anyone, but like. I want someone who's like got a track record, you know, legit, yeah. you know, it's gonna, you know, help my name get out there as well. But right. like someone that's like a good fit, and it, like, there's just not too many like new people that can like, like, carry that old school sound. And maybe that's a good thing, yeah. you know, to you know chart new territory. But at the same time, it's, you know, I miss the sort of like mashup of funk and like yeah. you know old school styles of music well that that's the approach i took with this track i mean yeah. if you if you would have sent me a, a track that sounded different you know sure if you would have sent me a track that sounded more quote unquote contemporary yeah, yeah. i would have approached it differently do you, yeah, do yeah you know what i mean yeah, yeah but but you you sent me what the, the song that you did yeah and it, like i said i mean it's it sort of like you know conjured up images of like average white band nice. or you know that's cool. like uh you know kind of like fred wesley and the horny horns or, <laughs> or hot chocolate you know i don't know if you're familiar with hot chocolate but like though that that kind of um that kind of sort of like down tempo funk you know? yeah so something you just chill bob your head yeah to. yeah and i love that that's my tempo like mid 90s yeah yeah like 92 to like 97 yeah. that's like you know every it's funny i learned that um i learned that uh talking to jaffe from from um preservation hall jazz band from, oh, from no new kidding. orleans and he's like what's your tempo i'm like what do you mean it's that's like, an interesting way to he's like, like come on man he's like come on what's your tempo <laughs> you know your tempo what's your tempo <laughs> I never thought about that yeah, before. Yeah, it's, you know, a, it's a cool way to look at it. Because I, I didn't want a tempo. I wanted to be able to do whatever, you right. know? I didn't want to think about it like, okay, I got this kind of thing that I do, and it's always in this tempo. I didn't want to think about that. Yeah. But he made me think about it. He's like, yeah. come on, man, what's your tempo? And Because we were working on a song together. Uh, we were working on performing a song together. And nice. that's when I was like, okay, if I really had to choose... yeah. What tempo do I like? It's like 92 to 97, and that's kind of where we are here. Definitely. You know? It's just like a nice, subtle groove you can bob your head to. And, yeah. But it's still like, like the instruments and like the, your vocal delivery still like hits hard enough where you're like, it's not like boring. And like you still rock out right to on. it. Like, Thanks, you know, man. Like, yeah. Like it has a lot of good energy. Yeah. Like you still work out to it or you could like sit back and smoke a blunt. And, right on. 